Business News at 5. Good evening. The Town of Tonawanda Police Department has suspended its SWAT team. The move comes as the department looks into what two of its officers may have done off the clock. We alerted you to this story this afternoon on the WKBW app. Seven Eyewitness News reporter Hannah Bueller has been tracking down the details tonight. Hannah. Well, Jeff and Ashley, I just got off the phone with Supervisor Joe Eminger, who tells me this is a direct result of incidents that have happened recently with two of the town of Tonawanda police officers just in the past couple of weeks. First, in late December, police charged Lieutenant Corey Flateau with DWI following a crash in Niagara County. He is suspended without pay. Then last week, 7 Eyewitness News told you about Officer Howard Scholl, who was involved in an off-duty crash following a SWAT team awards dinner at Sinatra's restaurant in January. Now, initially, accident reports obtained by 7 Eyewitness News showed Scholl's wife was driving the car when it crashed. But a week later, a new accident report showed he changed his story, putting himself as the driver. The town board has since recommended Scholl be removed from the force. Both of these officers are on the SWAT team, which is made up of 18 officers in total. On what the uh, has been, uh, you know, occurring uh, you know, uh, with a couple of the officers in the town uh, who are members of the SWAT team, I thought it was an appropriate action taken by our chief. Supervisor Eminger says this temporary su suspension of the SWAT team in no way puts the public at risk and the town is working with the town of Amherst where officials there tell me they are ready and willing to help their neighbors if needed. Now, Eminger also tells me the chief just needs to reevaluate his SWAT team and figure out what is the best course of action moving forward. We're live in the newsroom tonight. Hannah Bueller, 7 Eyewitness News.